all Americans will have more decisions to make on what vaccines to get. Most will, uh, not only will they need to be choose which ones, but flu shots will be available. There's also a new RSV vaccine for ages 60 and up. And Pregnant Mothers Plus, there's updated COVID boosters. Fox 13's April Baker looks into who should get what and when. While the change in season can be a lot of fun from the start of football games to leaf peeping, it's also a time to be more vigilant about planning for and protecting against viral infections. RSV, COVID, and the flu are top of mind for many moms like Robin, who is also an ER nurse. I'm worried about all of, all of the above. So we try to be careful with social distancing and wearing masks. Others aren't as worried. In Laura Rodriguez's case, she has a healthy track record. I don't feel that I'm susceptible to catching things. I, I just I just don't. I've not had cold or flu for years, so I'm lucky. But those in the medical field discourage folks from chancing it. They urge vaccines instead. We want to reduce the severity of the, the disease, and that's what vaccines do. Rich Lakin is the immunization program manager with the Utah Department of Health and Human Services. I talked with him about when people should schedule flu, COVID, and RSV shots. I would not get the flu shot right now. Lakin recommends waiting until at least September or October to get the flu shot, but getting it at least two weeks before Thanksgiving. Everyone six months and older is advised to get one. And while the updated COVID booster isn't available yet and age recommendations haven't been released by federal agencies, he expects it will be accessible around September. Ideally, it should be taken two weeks before turkey day as well. It gets colder. Um, that's when people start to stay indoors. You can get the flu and you can get the COVID together. We're not recommending that everybody over the age of 60 goes out and gets the adult um, RSV vaccine. Lakin says the decision to get the vaccine should be talked about with your physician first. That includes timing. While flu and COVID shots should be available next month, Lakin says RSV is already available, but there are certain limitations on how it can be administered here in Utah. He advises people to talk with their pharmacy about availability and options. Reporting in Salt Lake City, April Baker, Fox 13 News, Utah.